Hey Teddy, once again, we are going to be playing Amori today. Hope everyone's having a great day. Um, I'm not sure what I'm going to do if I don't get through the prologue today. I am still... I, I, it's confusing me, but it's fine. It is fine. Um, it's a nice day. If the entire game, game turns out to be a prologue, that's fine. Let's not worry too much about that. Um, though it does confuse me. Um... Yeah, same warnings as every other time, mature, mature stream, uh, even though absolutely nothing happened in the last, I, I mean, the last game, let's get the mouse off the screen, uh, last game, we simply just helped spa Space Boyfriend find uh, the mixtape. Nothing spooky happened until the very end, and then we got some bloody footprints, but that's about it, um. Which makes me feel like something's about to happen. It's hard to picture it not. There's one thing to have a slow burn, there's another thing to just be like hours into it. Um, the only thing about like Doki Doki is like, it didn't really tease anything at the beginning, so like the whole dropping it at towards the end of what you thought was the first game was cool. But this one, they've teased, they, they, well, it hasn't been teased. They've flat out have shown that this is a horror game. Um, but now, now I'm always kind of teasing us. Let's see. What is it, a couple of these? I don't feel like, I don't feel like doing all these at once. Because it's taking some time. And that's all pretty much recap. So we're just going to follow the bloody footprints to see where it goes. Oh. Yeah. I gotta f that being said, I kind of do want to actually recycle all my stuff because I am getting things for it. And I let's see what the flashlight is. Now that's an actual item. Plus for defense. Yeah, that's an actual item, so it's kind of this whole thing like, well, you know, you don't need to keep doing this, but I would like to. She got... Super high defense. You know, I, think, I feel like we should be building for attacks. I don't really... I don't really want to. Because she keeps getting hit. What was... Is it charm again? Just a bracelet. Okay, you have we have better than that. Attack plus seven. Yeah, these are the things I got in the last round. I didn't get a chance to look at. Yeah, let's just cycle for more things. I wonder if this is one of those mini things where, like, as long as you keep going for it, at some point you'll get, like, some really nice items. You get all everything you need to recycle in the world. Oh, if it's just random. This be the last one. For now. Alright, let's go. How much? How many clams? Yeah, I got plenty of clams. Blade footprints, blade footprints, blade footprints. Honestly, if you had to give my guess, give my guess, we're about to go into the real world and in the prologue. That's my guess. But yeah, we can just play and find out. Um, nope. As per usual, uh, first time we get to a picnic, uh, we'll stop and have some tea. Where Steve, I believe this is where Sweetheart was. All right. A wish? But what should I wish for? I have everything I can want right here.
Are you going on ahead? Don't worry about us. We'll catch up in a minute. Mango smoothie. So they've hinted at the fact that something has happened to Mari. Even though she's giving us picnics. Oh, I'm wondering. Watermelons are my favorite part of summer. These actually do sound kind of like what Mari would say. Um, I'm still going on the assumption that everyone's dead. <laughs> you know, it's just one of those games. You know, there's. You can make a couple of good assumptions that either everyone's dead, everyone's an aspect some aspect of your personality um, or sonification of regrets. Mari's cookies. Mari's cookies have much more love baked into them. I could eat them forever. And I think it was Basil who had who was seen the thing about Mari. Let's go this way. We're still young. We should dream big, right? Let's keep not going the way it wants me to go. Unless it's like that, I'm gonna definitely not go that way. This year, you get you get just one present from all of us. That's not a great sign. Real light's always good. Ooh, really fast now. Here comes the spooks, maybe. Who knows? It's just the F key. I really don't understand why the keys are so ominous sounding. Sheet music on a, on a music stand. All the notes have been scribbled out. A happy family. Is that it? All right, cool. Oh, nope. All right, back in white space. Let's see, hands, we've seen the hands before, but generally we think it has something to do with anxiety. Some blockage to anxiety. Let's see. None of these are new. Let's see if anything's on TV. On the laptop, anyway. Oh, that's right, because we're playing a hangman. Let's 
So F was not one of the letters we needed. And that kind of begs, begs, begs the question, do we need to be picking up all the keys? If it's Hangman, obviously if we get the wrong ones, something bad's gonna happen, right? Yeah. I'm assuming when I go into the menu, I'm going to have to uh, stab myself. Did I mention this already? So heads up, uh, yeah. Game, oh I did, but anyway. Again, game contains anxiety, depression, suicide, self-harm, flashing lights. Yep, there we go. All right. It was so pleasant. At that time, I saw everything. When you stood here before? Did you see it too? Something behind you. That's Basil. Three days left. I'm assuming that studio's left till the move. It happens in the real world. <laughs> it's actually it's actually daytime. Alright. Hey good hitty, it's mommy. How are you doing? Are you eating well? I was hoping I could make it back to see you today. But with it being the last day of a big furniture sale and I just can't resist a good bargain. You can take care of yourself for a few days, right? After all, yeah, that's gotta be some furniture sale. Be gone for a couple of days. Remember to finish your chores before I get back. I left a list on the table next to your door. Okay, that's it for now. Mommy loves you. Bye, honey. Do I play black? Sure, I guess. It's like an oil rig. Oh, you got to hit. Welcome to the rest of the stream. I'm just going to sit here and play blackjack for a while. Stay on eighteen. That's twenty five. That's twenty one. All right, that's enough of that. I have my knife on me. Got my steak knife. Maybe this is all just a metaphor for him not wanting to be a. Maybe he's a vegetarian. Maybe this is all a metaphor. No. Hey, mom's doulas. You don't feel like you need chores right now.
So we're hearing this knocking last time. At night. Hello? Hello? Kitty, are you there? Do you remember do you remember me? It's your old friend, Kel. So I uh I noticed a for sale sign in front of your house. And I uh heard from my mom that you're moving away soon. I was wondering if you wanted to hang out one more time before you go, or whatever. Full time sake, you know. <laughs> Why did it rotate the perspective? Open the door, though. Oh, he actually came out. So everyone's older. Fair. I mean... Okay, I'm gonna be honest with you, Katiti. I really didn't expect you to come out today, so I didn't really have a game plan here. Hey, now let's go to Hobbies. <laughs> it's a hobby shop in the Fairway Palazzo. You remember the way? No, I don't. We used to go there all the time when we were kids. Well, what are we waiting for? Let's go. We're not going to count that one. We're out of the prologue. It only took us five hours. But we're out of the prologue. I mean, even by even reading everything out loud... Let's say it took us twice. Like, that's still two and a half hour long prologue. Map, map. You shouldn't walk in the street, Goodity. That's dangerous. Dog. Wait, hold up, Gatiti. I know it's been a while since you've been over at, at my place, but now might not be a good time. I just want to pet the dog. Can you pet... No. Can you pet the dog? No. Whose house is this? There's no response. That's a lot of religious st statues. Knock, knock. There's no response. I'm on my way to the church, but it's a ritual of mine to take a quick stroll before delivering my sermons. I've had a horrible stage fright ever since I was a child, but a scenic walk always seems to calm my nerves. So this is the cat in the white space. What? Wait, wait, who? What are these creatures still wandering around? Who's that person? All right. So I'm seeing things that are not real. Great. Pretty boy. Life's been kind of stressful lately, but people watching 
out here helps you put things in perspective. I might make it a habit to come to this park more often. I guess sometimes all it takes to relax is to stop and smell the roses. An artist is diligently sketching away. Whoa, that's a cool drawing of the park you have there. Oh, hi there. Thank you. I'm just practicing. That's what you call practicing? But it looks so real. I bet you could even sell that for money. Don't you think? Yeah, absolutely. We're, we're, I don't know if anything makes... But we're going to see. Yeah. See? Even Katiti agrees with me. Heck, I'd buy that from you right now. Hey, Katiti, can you lend me 20 bucks? Yeah, thanks. That's so nice of you, but it's not for sale. It's for my portfolio. I'm trying to get into art school next year. Oh, darling, that's too bad. That would have looked great on my bedroom wall. You really think so? Mincy. Okay, now they have a name. My name's Mincy. What's yours? I'm Kel, and this, and this is Gatiti. Hi, Kel and Gatiti. So is this? Yeah. It's nice to meet both of you. It's nice to meet you too, Mincy. What's wrong? Oh, it's nothing. You're the first person to say anything positive about my drawings. Sometimes when I'm feeling down, it makes me question myself, and it gets hard to move my pencil. No way, I don't believe that at all. I really think your drawing is great. I wouldn't be able to do that in a million years. Don't be so hard on yourself, Mincy. Me and Gatiti believe in you. Sigh. Yeah, you're right. I just gotta shake off those bad feelings. I'll... I'll try to buckle down and finish this now. That's the spirit. See you around, Mincy. You got this. Hello, Yoggins. I don't know if you've been watching where you're stepping, but there's quite a lot of trash around this town. If you happen to find any, any you can bring it to me so I can so I can dispose of it properly. Come on, youngins. Let's stop the world one step at a time. Huff, 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 huff. Drink apple juice. Have you ever heard the phrase, an apple a day keeps a doctor away? The same concept applies to apple. No, it does not. Apple juice supports hydration, so does water. It contains beneficial plant compounds and may support heart health. It may also protect your brain as you age. There are no downsides as far as I'm concerned. Except for all the sugar. I got trash! Woo! Is there a map? Nope. Olive Beanie. I thought that was a name. When I was younger, my family used to come to this park a lot. I remember there being a lake with a statue in the middle, but I can't find it anywhere. Old Hobo. Oh ho ho. Hello. Cough. Yuck. Yuck. Cool. Today is such a beautiful day, don't you think? I may not have any money, but at least sunlight is free. I got trash. Ooh. Is this Is this what the old lady wants? I sure do. I got two dollars. <laughs> so here I was thinking that well, what? Thinking that the uh, like the uh, white space time place is like the main part of the game, and this was just kind of like a like an in between story. This may be just as big as the white space? <laughs> we are the Recycultists, followers of the Holy Ben. As all have littered, all must accept that they are trash. Reduce, reuse, and recycle. stench of this man is indescribable. What you making that face for, bub? See something on my face? Yeah. Jock. Oh, hey. What's up? What are you doing here, Kel? You're, you're from around this part? We're two blocks away. 
Oh, well, I didn't expect to see you here, Jay. This is Jay. He's the captain of the football team at my high school. I didn't know you played basketball, too. So I don't go to school? I'm not sure if these games really care too much about, you know, district boundary lines, but if our neighbors, we should we should be going to the same school, right? Yeah, look, I'm just here to kill time. It's more of a hobby than anything. You're trying out for the basketball team this year, right, Kel? Maybe you can teach me some of your tricks. Yeah, definitely, that sounds fun. But maybe another time. My childhood friend Katiti here is, is leaving town in the next few days, so we're hanging out all day today. I'll definitely catch up with you later, though. Sure, we'll catch up on... We'll, catch, we'll set up something next week. Same time, same place? Yep, sounds good. See you then. Alright, so... We know Kel's not dead. <laughs> Because they're right there. Unless there's multiple layers. I do not think there's multiple layers. But there's three days left. So I could see each day of us, we're spending another day with someone else. Like, next day we spend it with Hero. And the day after that, we spend it with Aubrey. And in that day, we figure out that Mari and Basil are dead. Maybe, maybe no one's dead. Someone's definitely dead. A large metal cat. I seem to remember being a lot bigger. Like it is in the white space. Oh wait, I got more trash. And then we'll save and then... I don't think we're going to have any picnics with Mari up here? Because she's definitely dead, probably. Um, we'll call that time for the first tea break, right? Oh, and actually, while we're doing this, I realize I never changed any of the settings for the new stream. So let's go fix that, too. Uh, the tea of the stream is a white tea. Uh, it was compressed in a cake. Not like the fooding white, aged white last uh, that we had last time. Um, this is just a regular white tea. This compressed in a cake for... I don't remember the reason why they did it. Um, but I have a lot of it. So I feel like this is a good time to use it. So because there's some teas, there's some teas I have that you kind of just want to sit and drink them. You don't want to want to be doing anything else at the same time, just because you kind of want to give them some attention. But if you have two, like it came in like a cake, like a prayer cake. If you've seen those, it's probably about two fifty grams. Um, so I got a lot of it, and I gotta get rid of it. Because I'm trying to cut back on the amount of tea I own. Let's see. Let's see. Do, do, do. And that's not even. Uh, I have a lot of tea. It's and it's a. It's kind of an issue. It's not really so much an issue. It's more of an idea of like, if you have a bunch of all these old all these teas. I should have put this through a filter. Um, kind of bounce around. You don't really want to do that. Um, 
I like just focusing on a couple of teas. So I, so after this first couple of year, these couple of years made me really into tea. So I'd get a whole bunch of tea all the time. Um, now I'm just really more like I just want to get like a lot of a couple of teas and not like a little a lot of teas. Um, but to kind of get to that point, I need to actually uh, drink down my collection. And these cakes of 250 plus grams worth of tea is not. not making it easy <laughs> but this would be a good time to do it uh just because especially like white teas you don't really, like uh, a big thing a lot a lot of these teas when you have when you're wanting to except for the stream because we do them like every time we come to a picnic um there are things that are happening to it like you're losing temperature of your vest of your brewing vessels which supposedly has some effect I have not done enough testing, and I don't feel like I want to do the testing to find out. So this white tea is called Skinny Dip, and it that does taste flat like zucchini, like a really fresh zucchini, which is nice. Give me a little bok choy. Listen up. When people say these things... A lot of times they're just saying the words that are matching. I had bok choy last night. That's the only reason I'm like, yeah, this tastes like bok choy. Um, I also do know that's one that a script they, the script they use a lot with teas. Um, but I did have it last night. I actually had zucchini last night as well. Okay. Oh, the stranger. I'm not sure how you feel about this tea. I may have over overbrewed it. <laughs> Hold up. <laughs> I am, I am, I haven't had this tea in a while. I'm not sure if it's aged that well. So I've had it for like a year. So aging that well is a lot pretty, actually. Yeah, about a year. Yeah, let's lift it. I'm going to get some water. It's not a great... Get that off the screen. Get that off the screen. Um, not a great sign for tea. You kind of want to be like, oh, I just had some tea. I'm thirsty now. That kind of gives me cotton mouth. Hmm. I have a... <laughs> I hope I overbrewed it because otherwise I got a lot of this tea to go through. Um, as soon as you see, it's a big part that causes what that cotton mouth feel it kind of dries off your tongue. Um, it's not a bad thing, per se. Well, I mean, it depends on your personal preference. If you don't like it, you don't like it. Um, then in any case, it's a bad thing. I actually kind of like it. A lot of the Japanese green teas have a decent astringency and bitterness attached to them. Actually, not so much bitterness, bitterness but astringency. And like a lot of the rock, Ruyi rock teas have been astringent. But it's a nice one. It doesn't make your entire mouth go cotton mouth. It gives you just a little bit, like a little bit of a drying in your tongue, which is nice. It's a nice texture. Um, this, how do I feel about this? I got a coin. Am I really just playing a game that's just like teaching you not to litter? Hey, it's Space Pirate. In Space... Captain Space Boy? He's not... I think he's... What was his name now? Guys, Captain Space Boy? I just made a wish that I would meet my one true love today. I got a coin. The coin fell straight to the bottom. Come on, Gatti, let's go to Hobbies first. Other Mart. So that's other land. No, I want to get the trash. If those fix-it signs are representative of the keyboard keys, ah, it's just ridiculous. I don't think it is. <laughs> Fine.
Well, here we are at Hubby's. It's probably been a while since you were here. But it hasn't really changed all that much. It's all the same old stuff. Captain Space Boy games, sweetheart movies, a few pet rocks. Okay, yeah, so it's Space Boy was... Sweetheart was Space... Captain Space Boy's... Captain Space Boy's girlfriend. Except now they're all vintage. Actually, since we're here, I should probably buy a gift for Hero. He's in college right now, but he should be coming back sometime tomorrow. He's studying to be a doctor, so maybe I should buy him... Some medicine? Yes, absolutely. No, that's a horrible idea. You should help pick out the gift, Kitty. Let's look around and see what there is. So everything that's happening in the other in the uh, other world, it's been years. A new video game called Super Ultra Sp Sprout Mole Eater: Revenge of the Moles 3. Rated the infant mature, huh? That's too violent for Hero. <laughs> you definitely wouldn't appreciate something like that. The series are pretty cool, but I think Hero would appreciate something more sentimental. Let's keep looking. Bunch of small figurines. I've always been fond of these little guys. Hero would get me at me for sitting on lunch mail and the oh, those that was words. Let's, er, let's not remind him of that. Chock full of comics. Looking through these comics brings back so many memories. It's just like old times, huh, Gatiti? Hero is never too interested in comics though, and I've been somewhere. Or not. This place is kinda small, but it has a lot of old and rare collectibles. People even come all the way from the city to shop here. Me over. Comic still. Blah, blah 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 blah. Books or DVDs? Books or DVDs? DVDs. A lot of these DVDs are catching dust. I'm sure you have most of these somewhere at home already. Probably also catching dust. An interesting post. Wow, that monster in the post looks so realistic. I'll bet fighting that would be a tough battle. So let's do it. What? This audio. I was concerned it was going somewhere. Hello? Gatiti? Where's the Gatiti? Whoa, a CD fell from behind that poster. Weird. I wonder who hit it there. I guess we can just take it? No, that's not how it works. You got a merry CD. This, yes, this is perfect. Papa Chips chip off the old block cookbook. Wow, that's a mouthful. Hero had a copy of this when we were kids, but our dog Hector, the pet rock, destroyed it. He's going to be so happy when he sees this. But before that, we need to ask the most important question. How much does it cost? Four dollars? Come on, four dollars. Twenty dollars? This is extortion. Shoot, I left my wallet at home. Uh, can you spot me, Gatiti? I'll pay you back, I promise. Thanks, friend. I knew I could count on you. I got $34. Oh, I remember I... When I was really young, I used to live in the Middle East. And there was an arcade game 
where you are on skateboards fighting monsters. I have never been able to find that game. Like I look for it, I look for it online. Like, what is this game? Can't find it. All right, let's see. I I got the money. Come on, been, buddy. It's been a while since we were coming around. Ugh, coming around, hasn't it? Ah, uh, that's Papa Chips. Chip off the old block cookbook. I see you have good taste. Yeah, my brother used to follow his recipes all the time. His cookies were my favorite. It's rare that I've seen another fan of Papa Chips work. That'll be 20 to Otha. You can give us a discount. Thank you, kind sirs. Please enjoy. You got a hero's gift. Thanks, Logity. I bet a hero will love this. Alright, now can I play? Yes. Oh my gosh. Alright, $14 to beat his high school score. Is that good? Oh, okay. So yellow things give you different power-ups. Gotcha, gotcha. Well, tickle me impressed. You got what? That wasn't hard. Guess I should make room for the new generation, huh? Here's your prize, as promised. I only go to set the people I think are really cool. I got cool glasses. Dope. So where do you want to go now, Gatiti? Guess there's really not much to do around the suburbs, huh? Well, how about the f how about the Fairway Park? Yeah, the park. We were just there. We passed it on the way here. Yeah, we did because we went in. That sounds fun, doesn't it? I guess. Let's talk to you. Guitar guy. Yo, I'm Michael, soon to be traveling musician. I've been playing guitars here at the Town Plaza for years now, but I think I'm ready to move on. Will you help me reach my goal? Anything will help. Let's go, Buck. Yeah, sure, why not? Hmm. Looks like I still have quite a bit to go before I can afford to leave town. Thank you. In return, I'll play you an original song. Please don't be copyrighted.
Don't quit your day job? Orange is the happiest color, don't forget. Nope, well that's fine, just so you know, the same concept applies to orange juice. It's vitamin C, blah blah blah. Stay for the record, the uh, apple juice guy wasn't so uh, territorial. <laughs> Welcome to Fix It. We can buy stuff and fix it yourself. What can I buy? After all this time, we finally moved in together. This is so exciting, isn't it, Sean? Yeah. This is the start of the... I guess it's probably made more exciting than Yeah, this is the start of the rest of our lives. Now it's time to make our first important decision. What color should we paint our house's walls? Hmm, I think anything would work. I like all the colors. What do you think, Sean? I'd go anyway, anyway too. Don't worry about me. You can choose Karen. Oh no, it's a Karen. Oh, Sean, you're too selfless. I don't need to pick a wall color. I'll be happy. Oh, oh honey. If you keep doing this, we can be stuck here forever. Hmm, you're right. Let me just close our eyes and pick a color. Oh, that works. That way the result will be completely impartial. Let's do it. Oh my gosh. This is the rest of the stream, everyone. It's gonna be this one. Wallpaper. The way to just damage all your walls, but go for it. It's fine. Oh, they're moving into my house. No. These keys. Excuse me, this is an RPG. Let me take the key. How's your day been? My day's been doing, going just great. Wanna know why? Because today's day I'm finally going to fix the leak in my roof. Nope. My problem began a couple weeks ago. I found a really stubborn leak in the corner of my living room. How I got there, I don't know. It wasn't very noticeable at first, but the leak has been slowly getting worse and worse every day. To tell you the truth, I've already gotten used to hearing the sound of dripping water and the feeling of a damp car you're gonna mold. But you know what? Today is the day everything changes. Yes! I'm finally here to fix it. My tools are ready, and I'm I'm going to fix it. Phew. Sorry. I'm gonna stop talking to people. I'm going to all these backyard. Oh my gosh. What is this? I have turtle shell. Seashell. No, I need I I should probably buy that. Right? Where'd they go? Just checking something really fast. What is going on? Yeah. 
According oh, there you go. That's fine. That is fine. Should probably just go to my house, go to the park. Candy. Yeah, it does. But we gotta find, we gotta find the connections between this world and the other world. Miss Candace, it's me, the happy and cheery Miss Candace. What would you like today, Smiley? Smiley. They do nothing. Rude. <laughs> smiley, smiley, we're gonna get out of here. She's gonna kill us. No, they're all gonna kill us. We're out of here. We are not coming back here for any candy. We'll get orange juice before we have to come back for candy. Bread. Can we go in the back? Phew. I don't... I hate, like, not talking to people. Uh... I don't know why I need health. What, am I fighting things? Maybe. Probably. We're just gonna speed talk to some people. I'm just gonna go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Probably didn't miss anything. I'm right. I take pride in being a musical connoisseur of sorts. I play a CD on the jukebox over there. I bet I can tell you who the artist for the track is. Alright, cool. I don't have a, the best memory, so like I I feel like this has some connection to the music in the other world, right? Right? That's the guy from Undertale, right, Toy Fox? Let's look this up really fast. Uh, also. Alright, so that's what Toby Fox looks like. Got it. Uh. <laughs> I'm kind of want this music to stop. Oh, I want to play an arcade game. Alright, let's, let's, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. I feel like we're going to walk around town. We're going to come back anyway in due time, in due time. Let's just, let's just do what... See what the game's telling us to do. Wait, don't go, please. Sorry, dude, I can't help you. You're on your own. Oh, there's some commotion going on over there. Let's check it out. This ain't none of my business. If you got beef with her, then talk to yourself, you creep. I'm begging you, just ask her to give it back. She won't listen to me. Is it Aubrey? Not her, but the person has... Wait, is that... 
That's Basil. Basil's still alive. Leave him alone, you bully. Hmm? Who's there? Oh, it's just Kel. Grumble, grumble. Why don't you mind your own business? Well, why don't you go bother someone else, Kim? Well, you're all acting a hollow high and mighty. You don't make the rules around here. What's going on over there? Biker gang. Oh, I got some scooters in there, too. Right? Is that a scooter? <laughs> she hasn't changed a bit. Oh, hey, Aubrey. This nerd Kel just showed up and thinks he can boss me around. Let's show him what we, what's what. Kel, what are you doing? What do you want? Stop messing with Basil. How could you? We all used to be friends, don't you remember? Tell her, Gatiti. Gatiti's here? Wow, it really is you. It's been a while, but you haven't changed a bit. How long has it been since you left your house? Three years? Maybe four? Must have been nice to live in your own little bubble. Watch it, Aubrey. You don't know what he's been through. Hm, whatever. Aubrey, please, listen to me. Hey, stop that. Leave it alone, Kel. This isn't your problem. What the heck is wrong with you, Aubrey? Uh, Gatiti, come on, we gotta do something. You guys are really picking a fight? Sure, why not? The two of you against me, how is that? Save the basket to save us over there. I was just thinking, like, I'm attacking with a knife. Yeah, this is not good. Oh shoot, Aubrey, are you okay? You're, you're, you're hurt. I'm fine. No, you're not, you're bleeding. Come on, we gotta get you out of here. Uh, I'll get you back for this. Yeah, like I was thinking, I, I, there's no way there's an actual fight going on here. Well, that was about to get really messy. Good thing you had your... No, it's not a good thing I had a knife. Wait a second, give me that. You shouldn't be carrying things around like that, Katiti. That's dangerous. Aubrey's really changed since you last saw her. Her and new friends have been nothing but trouble. Poor Basil. Let's check if he's okay. Hey Basil, how are you doing? Uh, I'm fine. Thank you, Cal. I don't know if he knows, but Katiti's here too. Say hi, Katiti. Oh, hey Katiti. It's been a while, hasn't it? Yeah. Woohoo, what a happy week! <laughs> so, did you want to hang out with us today? Oh, I'm sorry. I love to, but I I should probably head home. Oh, really? Are you sure? My um, my grandma hasn't been feeling too well lately. I'm sorry to hear that. Let us at least walk you home. It's been so long since we've all hung out. Oh, all right then. Thank you. We're gonna turn off something here. Oops.
do just ignore me I'm actually currently considering turning off the Nah, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Alright. Um. I'm gonna go save. Don't know where you live. It doesn't let me walk in the street. Basil's house, it's the one on the green roof. Um, thanks for walking me home. No problem, though. If you ever need anything from me, just ask, okay? I'll catch you later, Basil. Okay. Wait, please don't go. I mean, I'm so sorry. I actually have a favor to ask. Anything, Basil, what do you need? Well, you see, something important was taken from me. When we used to be friends. Do you remember how I used to take pictures of everyone? Of course I remember. Those photos meant everything to you. Oh, uh, wait. Well, Aubrey, she took my photo album and... Aubrey stole your photo album? Well, she... she won't give it back. No scumbag, don't worry about the theme, Basil. Me and Katiti got you covered. Ah, uh, okay, thank you. Yeah, let's turn that. By the way, about what you said before. We're still friends. I want you to know that, okay? Okay. Well, I'll see you later. Come on, Katie. There's no time to lose. We've got a photo album to find. Let's check out Fairway Park for clues. Can I see? Let's see what's going on. Bone. Small bone. Let's go fall. Looks like they're setting up for a sermon. You don't really want to spend your last days here hanging out at church, do you? But they looked weird. They looked ominous. Oh, trash, trash. We'll see you at the park. Maybe. It's 
something in that tree. We'll figure it out in a second. Yeah, I'm gonna save. Let's do some round two of this tea. Let's see if I can not. Let's see if we can get rid of the astringency. That cotton mouth feel. So, gotta hit the water, so while we do that, let's just cook around some theories about what's happening here. Uh, Mari, Basil, not dead. Aubrey, not dead. Hero, not dead. Um, and not, not Mari, uh, Basil, Aubrey, Hero, and Cal, not dead. Mari's, I'm still pretty sure Mari's dead. Um, and my guess is because of her death. I just came a shut in, didn't not leave my house. Um, Aubrey's probably upset because Kel and Hero had each other to deal with it. She did not, and me shutting myself in the house made it so that I had she had no one to help deal with it. I don't know if the time between being Basil run, has run off in the other world. So I'm almost wondering if Basil ran away? Like, I shut in, Basil ran away. Kel and Hero had each other, Aubrey was left alone. Um, she, well, obviously Aubrey wants the memories, that's why she had the book. That's, that's, that's my guess. We're gonna use a filter this time. Alright, I'm gonna be honest with y'all, the guy one I currently am using, I'm not a huge fan of. It's a bigger one, so I can make bigger things, which makes a lot more sense. If I'm gonna sit here drinking tea while I'm playing a game, it makes a lot more sense to bring brewing up, to brewing up. I think it's like 150 ml in this one, as opposed to my preferred, my, my favorite guy ones, which are like closer to 70. This is constantly re-steeping. Like, theoretically, I could do it. Um, I just have to change some things around up here. Again, the big part is I don't want to put all my stuff right next. Did I save? Um, I don't know. Let's see, did I save? I don't know. Just what the least amount of water next to my electronics. Though I could. It's still a lot. If I just gotta, hmm. we're gonna think of this through. So if I I could get one of the uh, the candle warmers, which actually I have, I do have some candle warmers, and just keep water. And I got a glass kettle. I could just, yeah, I could just do that. It's not the room. Actually, no, I don't want to do that. Um, the way that my tea room is set up, which which where I'm broadcasting from, uh, I I haven't attempted to move other places. Can. But I like my tea room. There's a lot of fabric on the walls, so candles need to be really watched closely, otherwise... 
Otherwise, it fires. Now nah, that just tastes like green beans. Yep. No one tastes like the skin. Like a green bean, like a, 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 a oh, what are they called? Snow. What are those ones called? The snow, snow peas. All right, let's talk. To this, let's talk to this tree. Uh, mm, looks like Aubrey isn't here. Oh wait, I know your name's Charlie, right? I see you hanging around with Aubrey sometimes. You know where she is? You know, Charlie, I can tell you're not really the mean type of person. Aubrey took something important from Basil. We need to get it back. Is there any way you can help us? <laughs> Who, what, and where now? What'd you do that for? Ah, if it isn't Kale and that weird knife guy. We're the adversaries of the great and mighty Angel. Finally, it's time for you to meet your doom. Angel, we don't have time for this. We just want to find Aubrey. Do you know where she is? You seek Aubrey, do, do you? Interesting. I'll tell you what I know. But first, you must best be in battle. I have a knife. Battle, but I don't want to punch a kid. You won't be able to lay a finger on me. Come on, let's stick him to Charlie. Are we actually fighting? Okay, I just punched that time. Now the question is, do those raising the attack to do the last? Oh, that's right, a Celtic my knife. You'll pay for this. Shelly wants none of this. How could this be? My training was all for nothing. Oh, my head hurts. You're the one who started it. You bully. Okay, Angel, it's time to be serious now. We beat you and Charlie, so tell us what Aubrey is. Hmm. Promise is a promise, I suppose. I'll honor my word and tell you what I know. He knows nothing. The truth is, Aubrey is somewhere in Faraway Town. Far away town, probably. Faraway, far away. Dang it, Angel. You better not be messing around or else. I told you I'd tell you what I know. And the truth is, I don't know anything. Angel, you better tell us where she is now. Or else I'll tell everyone about the time you you bet at summer camp. What? You can't do that. That's cheating. Anyway, I don't really know. We can ask my master, the Maverick. He's the keeper of all knowledge. He told me that himself. The Maverick? Oh no. You mean that weird kid, Michael? Don't you tell him to call him by that name. He would take great... Okay, so we saw one, Michael. Who is Michael at the playground? We need to find Charlene. Someone here is a... Oh, 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 oh! This is Beryl and Van. That's who this is. Because Van didn't went on a fight and he was... Yeah, this is absolutely Beryl and Van. Charlene a hobo. Is that what it is? Wait, so but so the two is the we cycle cultists. 
are in the are in the same, same spot as the Cloud Watchers, the Sky Watchers. Kind of. I'll tell you what I know, but you have to find. No. Fucking. Okay, fine. I'll talk. Master went to the fountain at the Fairway Plaza. He said he's going to meet some girls though for a date or something. Uh, disgusting. Come on, Gatiti, let's go to Fairway Plaza. Fairway, far away? We're gonna say Fairway, because far away sounds like a fake place. Um, and this is the real world, so we we'll call it Fairway. I think we're done here. Maybe. I want to find the analog for Charlene. Alright, let's... Hey, no, 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 I don't care, don't care, don't care. <laughs> After that, it's not. Oh wait, they also don't want you to buy orange juice. Okay, never mind. We are going to go buy medicine. <laughs> No! Plotline! I wasn't looking for a plotline, I was looking for... And then I told him, it's not Maverick, it's THE Maverick. Oh, the Maverick, you're so funny. What an amazing story, the Maverick. Girls, girls, please, there's enough for me to go around. Michael, no. What are you doing? Ah. But isn't Kel, my arch nemesis? Finally here to admit defeat, aren't you? I don't have time for this now. Look for Aubrey. Have you seen her around? Stop calling me that. I cast away that name a long time ago. Michael, what do you know? Do you know where she is or not? Dealing with a god for second name. Oh dear, you make a fool out of me. I have the map will not stand for this. Oh, I'm I'm not healed at all. I have my knife back. Probably not. This has no health. It's not really much. Not really much we can do. We just we don't have any skills. Please attack. Please attack your titty. I can heal. <laughs> Student of the blade. I actually might. I wasn't expecting a fight. Where's he guarding? Maybe not. I just don't. 
Probably may have to do this one over. Oh, I really heal. Oh, that's just rude. He made me angry, then he reduced my attack. So I'm just weak now. Oh, we can just calm down. games where it's like I I can absolutely win this because this is, the Maverick cannot deal more than like a 24 damage to me in a turn and I can heal 40 in a turn so there's nothing I'm just healing over and over again so just let me win Give me my knife. <laughs> I've learned the master ability of calming down. No one can defeat me. He's doing hitting harder though. I'm trying to remember what this game reminds me of. The whole, like, you most of it's in the childhood, but then you actually meet people and they're all grown up. What is that game? Oh, I'm angry. Let's do it. On the other side, this tea is a lot less stringent this time. Not sure what that was about the last time. It's not great. Actually, it's kind of simple. This is actually making me a little thirsty. It's not a good sign of tea to make you thirsty. Let me your str I. You. What is with this guy? He's so lame. This is worth ten dollars. Get out. Oh, he's paying people to hang out with him. That's sad. Please, please come back. I have more money. Sorry. Michael. 
There's no one here by that name. Please, I'll never ask you for anything. I'll never ask you for anything again in my life. Just tell us what Aubrey is and we'll go. Okay, fine. I do happen to know where she is, and I'll tell you. On one condition. He must call me my true name, the Maverick. Oh, forget it. Let's just go find Kim. She probably knows where Aubrey is. Her and Vans are major sugarheads, so I have a hunch that's probably somewhere near Candy. So let's go save, if it lets me. Alright, cool. I'm not a big fan of this whole time. Like, oh, you can't go any. Oh, I need to save. But I don't think it's healing me. It is not. Can I just eat these? Oh, I have trash. Five dollars? Alright, I'll take it. I'll take it. I need to get some first aid kits. Is this why the first aid kit is 150, which is exactly Kel's hit points? Knowing that you're not going to lose as good titty because you can just heal yourself 40 hit points, no problem. Don't make me go to the candy. I need to go to the medicine. Yes. I'd like three. That's a four. Can I use Calm Down outside of battle? Nope. That's a heal once. No point buying a first aid kit. I got this. Don't worry. I, I know how to navigate menus. I'm good. I, I swear. I swear. I'm good. I, I, I'm not great at video games. Can I trash it and then give it to the lady? Can I do that? Can I do that? No? Alright. Fine. Let's go talk to uh, Kim in Vance. Wait, no, that's... No, wait, Kim and Vance are Barrel and Van. So who's Angel and Charlie? Everyone is Barrel and Van. Oh, there she is. Hurry, Vance, let's shove it in the pockets before Sermon sees us. Hey, Kim, have you seen Aubrey anywhere? Shoot it, it's that nerd, Kel. Come on, Vance, we gotta go. Kel, hold on there. I don't think you paid for those. Get out of the way, nerd. You don't know me. Hey, hold on. I'm not here to snitch. We just need to find Aubrey. You know where she is? Hmm? Aubrey? I don't know anything about that. And if I did, I wouldn't tell you. I've had enough of this for today. Kim, let's make a deal. You tell me what Aubrey is and I won't tune in for stealing all that candy. I thought you said you weren't a snitch. And I don't need to be if you tell me what Aubrey is. You two again? I thought I told you to never come back here again, Smiley Smiley. Uh-oh. Hand over that stolen candy. Don't make me call it cops on you kids. Smiley, smiley. You've been busted. Man, okay. No, I'm still going with Angel and Charlie as Barrel and Van. Just because he kind of has hair resembling Van's hair does not mean he's... Here's just stupid candy. Well, there goes my leverage. No one's going to tell me anything. Come on, Vance. Let's get out of this dump. That serves you right. Wait, how are we find where Aubrey is now? Come on, Gatti, let's follow them.
Hold up one second, Titty. I think I have an idea. You Wait, you don't have any money. Kel lied to me. Grumble, grumble. Sorry, Vance. No candy today. No, not again. I don't know how much longer I can last. I gotta remind y'all that these people are high schoolers, probably. I'd assume. Because Hero's in college. He's not that much older. We're gonna die. Let's just go home. We're gonna be late for dinner. Wait, Kim, I have something for you. You can count. What the heck do you want, bully? Tell us what Aubrey is, and I'll give you this whole big bag of candy. Really? The whole bag? I mean, wait. You can't buy us. Yeah, I absolutely can buy you off of candy. You can take us for children. It's fine. Nothing wrong with it. I don't know, Kim. We haven't had candy for an entire week. And there's a whole bag right in front of us. We don't even have to pay for it. Can you at least ask if he has any taffy in there? Stop it, Vance. We have to stay strong. When we get to Dad's house, we'll be able to have all the candy we want. Okay. I'll do it for you, sis. Kim, Vance, I'm waiting. Lucky we'd accept candy from a bunch of nerds. Oh, man, really? I was sure that would work. This was a waste of time. Let's get out of here. Wait. Please, Kim. You're the only lead we got. I feel like we should probably know where she lives. Please take the big bag of candy. We, we even have taffy in here. Did someone say taffy? I see. That changes everything. Fine. You really want to know that badly, huh? Let's sell this for the fist. If you win, I'll tell you what Aubrey is. But if you win, you give us a bag of taffy and never talk to us ever again. Wait a second, there's no need to fight. You just tell me where she is, I'll give you this whole bag. But I want to fight. Come on, put him up, you two. It's time to duke it out. Those you guys been fighting. Well, I guess you have no choice. Come on, Gatiti, you know the drill. I'll show you the sizes and everything. I don't have to lose it to nerds like you. Kim started, so we're we'll, we'll gonna fight her. Ooh. Ooh. The people who are who, the people who are attacking are the ones who are more aggressive. Grumble, grumble, grumble. You're still nerds. I don't think fans did more than in the 20 range. So I should be fine. Now it's questionable.
You can still have taffy. Grumble, 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 grumble. Can't believe we lost. We never let Aubrey know. We can never let Aubrey know about this. Come on, Kim. We gotta go home. It's almost time for dinner, and Mom's gonna be really mad if we're late. Shoot, let's get out of here. No one's telling me any information. Wait, where do you think you're going? We won, so you can tell us who Aubrey is. She's probably at her house. Oh, yeah, that's right. We lied, and they're gonna run off. Aubrey's at the church, the one near her house. Huh? Aubrey's at church? Hey, don't look at me. You're the one who wanted to know. Also, if she asked you, told you, tell her it wasn't me. Say it was Michael or something. Come on, Cam, we got a scoot. You know how mom gets when we're late. Yeah, yeah, I hear you. Let's go. Smell you later, nerds. I'm not 60. Oh, at least we know where Aubrey is now. Or at least I think we do. Can't really imagine Aubrey at church, but I'll believe it when I see it. I don't know what juice is for. Uh, actually, doesn't one of these things cost juice? Yeah, nothing costs juice. I don't know any apple juice. It actually probably heals me. But it's two dollars. So unless it heals me for a hundred, I don't want it. Alright, we know where the church is. We saw it already. I wanted to see what they're doing, but they're like, no, you gotta go someplace else. Well, if I'd gone there, I would have seen Aubrey. Then when I have to find Michael, when I have to find those two, he's not looking happy. Let's see what Yeah, we're not gonna do that. We know she is. We know where she is. Game's really aggressive about not letting you walk in the street. It's like, no. Oh, this trash. So this is Aubrey's house? Ooh. Not really what I meant. I shouldn't be in this house. Nope, nope, you lose. Grumble, grumble. Rats. I guess I'll try again tomorrow. Here's a dollar, kids. Go get some candy or something. Right. I don't think I should just walk around this house. This seems... This seems wrong. <laughs> Grain juice in a can. I think that's beer. Again, this game is kind of totally weird.
Oh, is this, uh... Angel and Vance's house? Not Angel. Oh, what was it? Kim and Vance's house? I'm just curious if there's people home now. Well, here you are, Art. This really is the last place I would expect her. I'm kind of skeptical, skeptical, actually. It might be a trap. I'll open the door a little, take a peek. Hmm, looks normal to me. I think they're in the middle of a sermon. Oh, there she is on the right. Hmm, she's just sitting there. All normal, so weird. Yeah, I feel pretty bad about, bad about interrupting this. We should probably wait until the sermon's over or something. Is that a bike? Give me the option to wait. Expect you to walk just walking like that, Gitty. Well, so I'm turning back now. Come on, let's be really quiet. I just wanted to wait. There she is in the light. What kind of whisper? Aubrey! What the? What the heck are you guys doing here? We want to, to we want you to get back Basil's photo album. on about that? That's not your business. Really? None of my business? Y'all used to be best friends, but now this is none of my business? Yeah, Kel, exactly. We used to be friends. You know, Mario would be really sad. Ooh, don't bring her name up. Really? You really want to bring me up? <laughs> Why should Mario not even be dead? You really want to bring Mario into this? Who cares what Mari thinks? Yep, there she is. Mari's dead. Aubrey, seriously? What's wrong with you? I get that you have new friends now, but you just can't forget your old friends like that. My old friends? Yeah, they left her alone. Yep, there you go. My old friends weren't there for me when I needed them. Needed them. 
So that's what this yeah, it's, all, it's kind of legitimate. So that's what this is all about. When Mari passed on, we were all dealing with our own stuff. We were kids. It was hard. You think it's all so simple? You've always been simple, Kel. So what if I'm in? I'd rather be simple than be like you. How could you do that to Basil? You know how important his photo album is to him. It's important to all of us. That doesn't mean you can just steal it. Is that what Basil told you? I'm the one keeping it safe. What are you talking about? That photo album belongs to Basil, and I'm not leaving until you agree to get it back. Uh, you're so persistent. When Mari died, you moved on so fast. You know why I come here every week? Even after all this time, I'm still trying to find some peace. But it doesn't look like that's happening today. We haven't talked in four years, Kel. A lot changes in four years. You can get to you think you can just barge back into my life and tell me what to do. Don't be so naive. You might look different and act different, Aubrey, but you're still the same person. Hmm. The Aubrey you know is long gone. And the Aubrey that was your friend, she's long gone too. Okay, fine. I get that you're angry. Look, if it's an apology you want, here. I'm sorry, okay? I should have been there for you when you lost Mari. No. I won't accept this. Wait. Where are you going? Oh, yelling in church is rude. What's happening? Basil? Isn't it the boy who I've seen on him? Now she's... Oh. Oops. You think of the good guy, don't you, Kel? And I'm the big bad bully. My guess Basil was going to destroy the album. He had to terrorize poor defenseless Basil. If you're the one who hanging out, hanging out with a psychopath who carries around a knife... Now, now's not the time to do this, Aubrey. You don't get to say that. You're the one who barged in here. I already said I was sorry for everything. If you want me to be a bully, then I'll be a bully. You two better come at me quick. I'll come at you first. We're gonna run away. Oh. I just wanted to wait. Oof. Oh, people are judging her. Can we do something? Oof. Yeah, she got the first aid kit. That might not do it. Can you run? Nope. My parents are out. My mom is out looking for furniture for several days. Oof.
I like this game a lot more as a metaphor for themes. This, uh, no, it's just real. Oof. We have to do this all over again. I mean, these vanish. But she is more than. Right, Cal. Now, leave me alone. Ever since your father left, she's so uncontrollable, disrespectful, so bad for her mother. Shoot. I know she's been kind of messed up lately, but I still feel. Yeah, I'm. I kind of want to see if I can do that differently. Never mind. It is what it is. Yeah, it was bad. It was a horrible idea. I just wanted to wait. Let's go talk to the priest. <laughs> These people. Hey, buddy. Hmm. hmm. I usually wouldn't come down fighting in the middle of a sermon, but that seemed really important. That girl Aubrey has come here every week for the past few years, but she never talks to anyone. I've tried to approach her a few times, but she keeps calling me her bad things. She seems very troubled. Perhaps you could use a friend. Yeah, can I play the piano? Nope. Alright. Uh, I'm gonna go now. This is awkward. Goodbye. Later, nerds. Well, I was gonna walk in here. I still think there's a good decent chance Aubrey might live here. Is it hopefully not in the bathroom? I guess this is her house. Did you see that? Aubrey just dumped something into her trash can. Let's go check it out. Oh, I don't believe it. It's Basil's photo album. I can't believe she would just throw it out like that. It's a good thing we look through this trash can. But on the bright side, at least we only have we have Basil's photo album now. It only took us half a day too. Talk about teamwork. How about a high five, Gatiti? 
Yeah. Alright, let's get this basil. Hopefully it ends out the day. And we end up this in the stream as well. Knock knock. Basil, it's your friend Kellen Katiti. Oh, hello. Who are you? Hi, ba oh wait. You're not Basil. I'm sorry, my name's Polly. I'm Basil's caretaker. Oh hey Kel. What is it? Hey Basil, we got your photo album back. Huh? You did? Wow. Thank you. You gave Basil back his photo album. Basil, you didn't tell me you had friends coming over. Would you like to join us for dinner? That always seems to cook just a little too much. Dinner? Sure, sounds delicious. Come on, get to eat free dinner. Yeah. I can only talk for so long before my mouth goes, yeah, we need to stop. It's actually a couple minutes. Um, let's be out real. Please make yourself at home. We're gonna rummage around everything. I'll go ahead and finish up the food. Wow, it's been a while since I've been in here. You definitely have a lot more plants than you used to. Yeah. Yeah, I like them a lot. Actually, there's some that are still alive from when you guys came here more often. Oh, you, got, you sure are dedicated. Yep, there's that's basil for you. Flowers and photos. Oh, that reminds me. Now that we got your photo album back, we can go through the photos together. Uh, that's, yeah. I don't know. It's been a while since you looked through them. It's ha yeah, Basil was trying to get rid of it. Now we wanted to save him. Come on, it'll be fun. Um, sure, okay. Here it is. My first photo. My best friend Gatiti trying out his new violin. He's starting to take lessons again so he can play at recitals with his sister. Oh. I feel like we've been we knew this. Samari so was my sister. So exciting. Nope, no, 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 no. Just Kel being Kel. So many party hats. Continue playing a video game on the couch. Continue's a little shy, but he's a real good listener. I always end up venting to him when I get upset or stressed. Sometimes I feel like I'm bothering him, but he never seems to mind. We're back in the park, but Kel is still full of energy. He challenged Hero to an arm wrestling match, but we all know who's gonna win. Please go easy on him, hero. Oof, sorry, Cal. Better luck next time. Why is it going from 3 of 9 to 3 of 10? Cal is still feeling a little sour about losing a hero in the arm wrestling night, so his hero decided to lean in for his mooch. Cal looks so annoyed. Ah, brotherly love. Me showing Gatiti a book I've been reading. Mari stole my camera and took this when I wasn't paying attention. I should really keep better track of my things. Aww. It's all of us cutting, cuddling with Gatiti's stuffed animals. Yes, so many and all so soft. I wish I could just lay here forever. Mari is teaching everyone how to make flower crowns. Here's Gatiti and Kel holding Mari's examples. You ever feel like you guys stop getting... Like, my... I, I feel like my name's a little inappropriate for this game. It's fine, it's fine. It's fine. It looks perfect. It, it look, does look perfect. If only you, Mari thought so, too. Hero's still making his flower crown. It's taking him a little while, but he's getting there. You have to admire his persistence. It's raining super hard today. 
Oh, they're dates. That's what those numbers are. <laughs> they're dates. Super rainy today. The rain always seems to come out of nowhere during springtime. Aubrey asked me to take a picture of her with a new raincoat. It's her favorite color, pink. Aubrey won't let Kel under the umbrella, but Kel seems to be taking it just fine. He says he, like how the he likes how the rain tastes. Kel just being Kel again. Went to Hobbies, but the shop owner told Kel to leave his jacket outside since Kel was getting all his comics right. Sorry, sorry, shopkeep. It's been pretty busy with school lately, but we finally made it to time together to go into the park today. Feels Kel hanging, his, Kel hanging his legs off a tree. He's such a good climber. I wish I was as fearless as him. It's the first day of summer vacation, so we all wanted to celebrate, celebrate by going to the beach. Watermelon is Aubrey's favorite. Have we seen a photo of Mari? Kel cooling off with some refreshing orange juice, Joe. I should get too close, he might get my camera wet. I've forgotten who has a camera? I kill We're looking this up. I must know. Basil. Of course. Basil has a camera. <laughs> we burned Katiti in the sand. It took forever, but he looks like he's enjoying himself. I wonder if he's going to need help getting out. Oh! So this, this is this is what uh, you're seeing in the sand. Uh, I forgot what, this, what they put. Bob? Was it just Bob? But in the... Uh... But in the white space playground, there's just these heads in the sand. <laughs> I was like, there's a clue, a clue! But no, it's just, it's just, it'll just tell you. Even though me, Katiti, Aubrey, and Kel are in the same school year, Katiti is younger than all of us. He's the baby of the group, so we have to take care of him. Katiti's holding a super huge present from Mari and Hero. Hmm, I wonder what it is. I got the cat. You can't really tell from the photo, but Mari and Hero got Katiti a giant building block set. Katiti is much more interested in the block box, though. He's acting just like Mari's new kid in a Mew. Yeah. Okay, that's the cat. Katiti won't leave the box, so Kel put a food bowl inside. <laughs> I guess this box will be Katiti's and Meow's new home. We're going beetle catching today. Here's Carol ready to pounce on his next victim. Oh, and Katiti is there too. He looks kind of sleepy. I went to the bathroom and came back to this photo. Carol said he took a picture of himself on accident. I don't believe him. It's the first day of school today. Me, Katiti, Carol, and Aubrey are up bright and early. Aubrey is so photogenic. Goodbye, Summer. Until next year. Nope, oh, nope, oh, wrong button. Wrong button. So there, yeah, there's all these photos that I'm missing. Which I'm assuming, yeah, I mean, they all have to be photos of Mario. Them. Oh man, it looks like it looks like a lot of the photos are still missing. Maybe Aubrey cut them for herself. We have to get those back later. On the bright side, look how short I was. I know I've grown at least a foot since he left for college. I can't wait for him to come back. This year I'll finally be to be the taller brother. 
Anyway, don't sweat it about the missing photos, Basil. Me and Katiti will take care of things for you. You just focus on going back to your happy care for yourself. Okay. Thank you. I'll try. Get your sister's way. Okay. We gonna snoops. We're not gonna snoops that much. All right, so that, that's that's why this is the caretaker. All right, there's a book. Clues. Nope. Tonight for dinner, we'll be making chicken and vegetable soup. How's that sound? Soup and veggies? Sounds nutritious and de delicious. You really think so? I was afraid to be a bit disappointed. People always tell me my tastes are a bit bland. Don't worry about what other people think. All food is good to me. I'll eat anything you throw at me. Dinner will be ready soon. Please feel free to make yourself at home. Am I supposed to go talk to... It's nice to finally see you again. Why are you staring at me? I, I'm trying to... I... Fine, fine. Oh! Yes, I would like to save. I'm a little insulted that Jesus' food is boring. This is my food. That's essentially my fridge. <laughs> yeah, that is literally my fridge right now. Um. <laughs> uh, okay, um. The fact that this is a save point here makes me feel like. I don't know why there's a save point here if we're not going to be done soon. All right, let's go talk. Let's we'll talk. All right, that's 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 it. That's it. All right. What it wants me to do to progress the plot line? Am I supposed to kill? Uh, am I supposed to kill the grandmother? That doesn't make any sense at all. <laughs>
I hear you. A white egret or orchid, or orchid, orchid. When the language of flowers, it symbolizes symbolizes the phrase, my thoughts will follow you into your dreams. What are you doing here? Oh, good to see. I didn't expect to see you in here. Yeah, I shouldn't be in here, but you forced me into it to progress the plot line. How are you doing, Gatiti? Is everything okay with you? Okay, never mind then. Grandma can't hear us, you know. She hasn't been feeling very well lately. It's already been four years, hasn't it? So if Hero's in college now, that'd have been. F that means Hero would have been freshman in high school four years ago. Um, I also make the assumption that I think Mari and Hero are the same age. Here, take my photo album. I want you to have it. I'm entrusting you with it, okay? I just think you can probably use it more than me. Basil will give you his photo album. A lot has happened since these photos were taken, pictures were taken. Sometimes it feels like it was all a bad dream. It's hard to remember now, but I think at that time, I took photos of what I was most afraid to lose. Flipping through this album, you can still see, see the good times. Maybe one day, things can go back to the way they were before. Katiti, Basil, dinner's ready! Okay, coming. Yes. Everything tastes so good. You're the best, Polly. Well, it's nothing. I was just following Grandma's recipes. Thanks for the help, Kel. Munch, munch, munch. So as I was saying before, Polly, tomorrow, my older brother, Hero, is finally coming back from college. My mom's all crazy right now, preparing the house and everything. Munch. Don't want to be anywhere near that. Don't want to be anywhere near that mess. Although, munch, I'm pretty excited to see him. Every time he comes back, the first thing we do is compare our heights. This year is the year that I'm, so he's not a, he's older than a freshman in college. Finally gonna be taller than him. I can feel it in my bones. You and your brother seem close. That's good. That's good. Family is important. Oh, hey. What should you do with Basil's photo album there, Katiti? Oh, I, I gave it to him. I just thought he should have it. Whoa, really? That's so cool of you. Makes sense. Especially since Katiti's moving away and all. What? Katiti's moving? Oh yeah, I thought I already mentioned it. I must have forgot. He's moving in three days, I think. Sorry, I thought you already knew. Oh. Uh, no, I guess I must have missed it. Sorry. May, may I be excused? I have to go to the bathroom. What's up with him? Munch. Well, that's just how it is. When you gotta go, you gotta go. Kinda gotta go. Ooh. Should have saved. Should have saved. I'm not expecting these things in the real world. Oh, it's you, Katiti. You're here. I'm so glad. You you can see it too, can't you? Something behind you. I'd like to go. Wait, please, Katiti. Don't leave me. Not again. 
I didn't mean to leave you. No. Uh. Yeah, so we may follow this through and not save. Uh, I kind of did not mean to leave. I was just trying to look behind me. Uh. I... Oh, hey, good titty. I think it's about time we went home. It's way past my curfew. So, yeah, anyway, Polly, if you ever need me, here's my address. I live just down the block. Thanks, Kelly. You're so sweet. Oh, it's nothing. Say goodbye to Basil for me. Alright, so we're gonna save here. But we're gonna save it here. So we're gonna call that we're gonna call that a stream. That was almost two and a half hours. I didn't really mean to go that long, but this game does not have good stopping points. What well, actually it had plenty of good stopping points. Um, I may go back off stream because I don't really want to deal with it again. Even though it's only ten minutes, and see if I can s stay in there. Um, just because I prefer to do that. Um, it's already been making me do choices I don't want to do anyway. I wanted to wait in the church. Um, so I'm going to see if I do that. If I can, <laughs> it's gonna be annoying. If it does, I'll reload. If it does, I'll start again. Well, I'll start again from the save point, get to the point, get to that part, and we'll we'll start from there. If not, we'll start out from this point as well. Um, all right, y'all have a good day. Uh, tea of the stream was a compressed white tea, uh, called Skinny Dip. I would actually say it got better as it went along. I don't know what that first that, that first brew was. I don't know. I felt so cotton mouthy. Um, but it got better. It was, you know, if you like vegetal, go for it. Um, skinny dip. And honestly, this one really fast. This is what I'm, I'm trying not to name vendors. Um, just not for any real reason. I mean, it's a complicated, not really complicated. It's just personal preference. Um, that being said, when it has a name like skinny dip. You can find the vendor. <laughs> Alright, but anyway, uh, y'all take care. I'll probably actually, honestly, I'm probably back here tomorrow. I'm really digging this game. It's. I don't know. I, I'm really digging it. It's it's a little. It's a little too real, um, <laughs> to be perfectly honest. Uh, but it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's cool. Um. Alright. Uh, take care, and y'all have. I think I said it, but yeah, take care.